Hello there, folks. Welcome to today's episode of The Chicken Minute. I'm your host, David Shulin. In today's Chicken Minute, we're going to discuss one of the icons up here in the top right corner of the screen. There's a whole bunch of icons that do a whole lot of different things in your software. Uh, we've discussed many of them in these videos before, and I want to today discuss the light bulb icon, the Chicken Insights icon. We do not discuss this often. Uh, when Chicken Analytics was originally created, if you wanted to view the insights online, not in your email, you did need to go to the light bulb, the Chicken Insights. Since then, we have created the dashboard. The dashboard was added a couple of years ago. Your insights live right on the dashboard, right in your face when you log in. We can see the market insights here from Mark Chaikin and, of course, afternoon insights from last week from Pete Carmesino, and then back to last week's market insights uh, from Mark as well. But this icon, Chaikin Insights, still can be useful for you even with the dashboard available. Uh, I do want to add that clicking the Chaikin Insights icon and the clicking see all right here bring you to the same place. These are the same thing. So what would we be clicking these icons for? Let's give them a click. First and foremost, uh, when you click the insights, you will, of course, see the most recent insights. Uh, you know, if we were to click see all right here, we can see of course, previous insights, not just the few that are listed. And that's really the primary reason we would use this, would be to go back in time and see some previous insights, right? So this is going through previous market insights. That's what this is defaulting to, just the market insights from Mark Chaikin from Monday mornings. Here in the top left corner of the screen, we see a bit of a menu. And the second item we see is afternoon insights. You wanted to just look at the afternoon insights, uh, afternoons Tuesday through Friday from Pete Carmesino. Clicking here would show you those. And you'll get the initial uh, kind of highlights. And of course, for any of these, you would click continue reading to see the full insights. There are a few other items here that I think are important to mention. We'll get back to this in a second. When it comes to insights, I want to actually real quick. The next one is member content. This is the same as the microphone icon that lives here, right? This microphone icon, which sometimes glows red. It glows red when there's new content for you to see. Uh, typically speaking, and under member content, we post here three days a week. We post here, well, excuse me, two days a week, three items, Wednesday and Thursday. Uh, on Thursday afternoon, we post the video update on the current market environment, a 10-minute video from Pete Carmesino all about the current market conditions. We do the same thing on Wednesday in a midweek market update. And Thursday mornings, we post our list of liquid options uh, on stocks and ETFs from our friends at Options Play to help you with slippage to make sure you're looking at only uh, liquid options, right? Uh, stock may be liquid doesn't mean the options are. So that's what this is about. So all of this is right here. Uh, you can again get to the member content by clicking the microphone, uh, but the Chicken Insights light bulb will allow you to access it here on the left as well. At the bottom on this side, we see the archives section. The archives section also has a calendar. Yes, you could pick or choose any particular day and look at the calendar for that day. What got posted? Back on Wednesday the 4th, we had our afternoon insights. We had the midweek market update, uh, both on that day. You could go way back in the archives, folks. All right? If you wanted to see what we were talking about in June in 2016, here you go. You can do it. The information is available for you. Uh, a couple photos, old photos look to be missing from about five years ago, but you can still read all the commentary, you know, uh, as the pandemic was starting, right? Back in February, what was Mark talking about? We used to write the market insights on Sundays. Here you go, right? All the information available for you at your fingertips also, you can search. 
You could search insights. I don't know. Right? We can start looking for when we started talking about a pandemic um, back in March, first one, right? Pandemic directly. We also have a quick shortcut to the portfolio health check for the S&P 500. Uh, you can run the portfolio health check, of course, of course, on any list from the workspace. But uh, this is just a quick shortcut to get a better overview of the S&P 500. All of this information is available for you right under the light bulb icon or by clicking see all uh, in the insights on the dashboard. We hope you've enjoyed today's episode of the Chaken Minute. We'll see you again tomorrow.